He's arguably one of the best fighters in the UK. He's, he's easily the best now. Uh, the most decorated Thai fighter in Welsh history, really. I thought, who is this kid doing this to me? Because he was exceptionally good. Oh, 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 no. oh, no. oh, no. oh. Mike Egan, from the sleepy seaside town of Llandidno, rose to become one of Wales's most successful Thai boxers. What drove this man to become a world champion in one of the toughest, most aggressive sports on the planet? And will battles outside of the ring bring an end to his illustrious career? It was around lockdown, like maybe halfway through lockdown, and I was starting to feel like a little bit tired here and there. It wasn't until I did a biopsy on one of the lumps that it came back and they said that I had cancer. And that was probably the big, the hardest, hardest moment of my life. I had had it in my mind that I was going to do this all along while I was in the hospital. So the minute that he said I could spar and things like that, I was like, right, this is where the road starts to get him back in the ring. I have to do whatever it takes to win. That was it, like just my mentality the whole time. I think I'm going to break every bone in my body if I have to to win this fight, as long as I win, because that's what matters more than anything else.